Begin this half hour with a dramatic rescue from this burning car. Two children and their mother suffered serious injuries when their car caught on fire in Wilmington. That's right, Good Samaritans jumped into action to save that family. This afternoon, all three are recovering as their loved one is opening up about this scary ordeal. Action News reporter Taronda Thomas has that story. This fire burned so hot. Take a look at what it did. It left burn marks in the road. Still, several men who work nearby jumped into the flames to save two children. They have like a little business here. They wash cars. Seeing everything that happened on the corner of Walnut Street and A Street in Wilmington. But what happened Monday night is something they'll never forget. A fire that sent smoke billowing from a car. Inside, a mother and her two children. The mother escaped but needed help for her children. They said they didn't even think about it. They just started running this way and helping her out. Eight-month-old Aliyah Hawkins and six-year-old Dante Hawkins were trapped inside. With the intensity of the fire, he, he couldn't see. He could hear the baby crying, like really loud and screaming, and then was able to go in within seconds and unstrap the seatbelt. The men described how they saved the children with Wilmington firefighter Alex Ortiz interpreting, but no interpreter needed for this moment. Harlan Hawkins knows their actions saved his loved ones. Tip my hat to him. Tip my hat to him. That's something you ain't have to do, man, for real. You ain't have, you ain't have to do that. He's thankful for the men who rescued the children of his niece, 22 year old Loria Anye Hawkins, who is like a daughter to him. He was telling me was, well, that he grabbed the baby or stuff, so. Saving them before firefighters arrived to put out fast moving flames. The intensity of the fire just built so fast that apparently what they found after the fact was that there were fireworks in the trunk. A lot of them have kids. Um, so that was the first initial thing that they thought about. Fathers and now heroes for saving two young lives. They were able to do what they were able to do and, and, and save somebody's life. The mom and children both have second and third degree burns. The mom, though, has been discharged from the hospital and loved ones believe the children will also pull through. In Wilmington, Delaware, Taronda Thomas, Channel 6 Action News.